what's your initial thoughts on reaching your third world final? Uh, more relation than anything else. Uh, I felt a lot more pressure out there this time than what I did two years ago when I was playing nearly in the semi-final to get to the final. And then whether it's because, like you say, to get to another final and have a chance to win it for the second time, now I have won it before. Whether it's that bit of pressure, I'm not too sure, but I definitely felt a lot more edgy this year out there. I mean, not just in the semi-final, but in, in most Seven. matches, really. Now, your preparation's slightly different for this one, of course, and you took a bit of time off. Is that just to try and stay fresh for the Crucible? Yeah, yeah, and at the minute, I mean, it seems to, it seems to have worked. Performance-wise, it's, it's not been too good, but as far as the results, I mean, I'm, I'm still in and I've still got a chance to win it, so it seems to be working at the moment. Was that to the detriment, do you think, sometimes of you know, your match play, really, not having a couple of matches coming in, or do you, do you think you've, you've yeah. got away with it a little bit? Yeah, possibly, because, I mean, I, I was still putting the hours in practising on my own at home, but when you're playing on your own, you feel as though you're playing well, but because you're not tested, you don't really know where, you, where your game's at, and uh, I didn't really practise with anyone coming into the World Championships. Joe Perry asked me for a game, but we were quite close to each other in the draw, so I didn't bother doing that. But, I mean, yeah, in, in patches I've seemed to be caught out, but I've, I've, I've sort of got away with one, really. Now, what about your thoughts on your opponent, Ding Junhui? He's been flying, making centuries all over the place. It's going to be a tough game, isn't it? It, it will be a tough game, yeah. I mean, I, I need to, to up my game and, and score a lot better as well. As you say, Ding's playing fantastic. I think he made six or seven centuries in his semi-final game, so... I know what I'm up against. Sometimes I tell myself I'm going to be positive, then I go out there and I'm not. I can't afford to go into my shell against Ding because I've got no chance of winning. Now, experience, is that going to be an advantage? Because obviously it's the first time Ding has been in a Crucible final. It must count for something. Yeah, I suppose so. I mean, as you say, I still need to get off to a good start uh, and, and capitalise on that because I suppose if Ding's going to feel anything, it'll probably be at the start of the match. So um, if there's a little bit edgy there, hopefully I can capitalise on, on a good first session. And funnily enough, if you win, this will be your first trophy this season. Hard to believe, isn't it? It is, yeah. I mean, I, I won a, a smaller PTC, but as far as the main ranking events, I've not won anything as such, as you say. So for this to be my first tournament, it's not a bad one, I suppose, in a season. Now, I probably know the answer to this, but what would it mean to you to win two World Championships? Oh, it would be amazing. I mean, even when I won my first, it was a, a fantastic feeling. Everyone back home was saying, oh, great. If you win it again, it'd be even better. And, well, I've given myself a chance by getting into final again. So, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll be trying my hardest. And if I do win it for a second time, it will be quite emotional, I think. It's been a wonderful season for, for the city of Leicester, hasn't it? Looks like they're going to win the Premier League. Mark Selby could win the World Championship. Will you stop texting me then if you do that? <laughs> Possibly, yeah. I mean, I'll, I'll probably still send you the pictures of the Premier League trophy with, with Leicester on. But, uh, yeah, I mean, unbelievable, really, as far as the football club goes. I mean, this time last year, there was like struggling to stay up and now... They've been top of the Premier League for the majority of the season and, and look really close to doing it. So hopefully they'll do it Monday night. Hopefully I'll do it.